Here's a behind the scenes look at what two science teachers are doing to help students in New York State pass the living environment regions. What we did was we went through the August 2013 regions question by question identifying the topic, a subtopic, and the concept and the answer for each question uh, going all the way down through uh, 85 questions and then we did that again with June 2013, January 2013, August 2012, January 2012, and June 2012 doing that with each exam and then we pulled them all together combining them into one spreadsheet and then alphabetized it by topic so all the Beaks and Finches question here and uh, if you go down you could just see the repetitive nature here of the topic and the subtopics as well as the concepts and and ultimately what this is all going to look like if we go down a little further here is these red sections are ones that we've completed already for example there are uh, questions on succession in the ecology topic one from each exam and if we go to PowerPoint uh, slideshow here uh, where is it? Succession right here. So this is ultimately going to turn into a video from a PowerPoint presentation. But this will have all six questions on succession. And then there's uh, another one that I want to show you here on selective breeding. Uh, this question came up five out of six times and these are the questions in the exams. And here it is on the uh, spreadsheet here showing you what those questions are. Right here, one, two, three, four, five and the exam. So ultimately when this is done, we'll show you the finished product uh, once it's all completed, but hopefully this helps. Okay, back here in PowerPoint, and uh, you can see here a bunch of slides that were finished. We are about halfway done at this point, and here's you know just what finished slides look like. Uh, but actually, what I want to show you is going back to the top for a second. Uh, one of the slides we mentioned earlier was selective breeding. Uh, in the end, we wound up using one, two, three, four questions, and you can see a lot of lines. It looks you know not as busy as some of the other slides, but definitely took some time, and you can see all the animations uh, and the timing for that. Uh, very time-consuming process and uh, here with the ecological succession this slide looks very busy uh, in the end there were one two three four and I think there was a fifth question buried underneath here and uh, but to not make it busy to the viewer uh, it took a lot of time to find these questions but even more time to to put the storyline together to to f make the concepts flow uh, so our viewer can can watch and get the explanation down pat and then the timing to bring the pictures in and take the pictures out definitely took a lot of time and as you can see down here you know we're up late uh, it's, uh, towards the end of March and uh, you know we still have a, a bunch of slides to do but you know we hope to get it done so you guys can reap the benefits of this and, and pass the living environment regions. And with an anticipated release date of Monday, April 28th, 2014, here's what you can expect. 50 concepts, 50 videos, 50 quizzes, unlimited access, available 24-7 but only available at biovideotutor.com so join the waiting list today.